So I just wanted to go over what I bring with me for 14 days of travel. So I'm not yet a minimalist and so it's maybe a little too much and I can mention what I have um, too much of. Uh, but gener generally um, this is much less than I had before when I went traveling. So first I have a 40 liter uh, backpack and um, that's uh, I think it's very good solid uh, backpack as you can see I have use it right now for water bottles on the side I have with me this um, which is a, a sleeping mat for sleeping in uh, so you don't sleep right on the ground it's quite light uh, I think it's like 600 grams um, I also have this um, uh, it's not a sleeping bag it's uh, uh, I figured it's so warm here that I don't need a sleeping bag so it's lighter than that four socks plus the ones I'm wearing I'm planning that I can go barefoot sometimes maybe so I don't need so many and uh, boxer shorts I have six I also have this winter gear from Norway. You have a sweater and a rain jacket. I think I maybe I will need this. And some uh, pants that are also waterproof. Um, I will not need the sweater or the pants here because it's uh, really hot. Uh, I also brought with me these pants that are like sleeping pants. Uh, what I figured out is, uh, yesterday night is that they are way too thick and I will never use them. I brought a small towel. I don't know if I will use it or not. Um, and two shirts. I think um, that's good. Then I have three shirts in total. Uh, T-shirts. Um, uh, yeah, I brought... Uh, I have one shorts on me right now and I also brought one short I'm not sure if I really need it but it I think it will be nice to be able to change between them and I also have uh, toiletries something to shave and some sunscreen and um, uh, some toothpaste a scarf I have a really sensitive neck, so um, when it gets cold or somebody turns on the air condition, I put on the scarf. Even though, if I, even if I'm wearing t-shirt, then so it looks kind of stupid. But flip-flops, I find them really, really handy to have in the hotel uh, or hostel uh, to walk around in, um, so you don't have to walk directly on the on the floor. Uh, there is a weight for weighing the bag before you go on a plane or something. Uh, these are just some foods that I have right now that I buy locally. Uh, same with the water bottles, I didn't bring them. And I brought this small, small uh, backpack. It's uh, probably totally waste of time, uh, waste of space. Uh, because I have this 40 liter backpack and I carry it around any, everywhere anyway. Um, but it's it's very small and foldable and I don't want to throw it away just yet. And there is just some a cup and um, I use water bottles so I don't need cup and I'm not drinking tea uh, during this trip. And uh, some um, some chargers and stuff. What I didn't mention is I have a hat and I also have these bracelets for protection against the sun. So try to use as little sunscreen as possible and instead I try to cover myself, walk in the shadow when possible, which is not very easy when walking the El Camino. And um, that's it. Every time I travel, 
I learned that oh I didn't need that I didn't need that and you even if you start to cut really down on what you bring with you you very seldom need most of the stuff you bring so uh, traveling especially when traveling with a backpack that you have to carry all the way all the time really teaches you the value of bringing as little as possible that's for all from me today see you guys later